and Countess Yvonne of Lanexeter's necklace. Your handiwork, wasn't it? It was. I scaled a gutter, entered her bedchamber. Ha! <laughs> I knew it, I knew it. Ah! At last, we're all here. Time to begin. This heist, it's no jest. So if any of you has any doubts, isn't sure, now's the time to leave. Won't be able to after. Let's begin. Prime. Just one patrol. Mixture of yours must have worked. Eveline, you ready? Are you kidding? Of course I am. Three, two, one. It's clear. On your way. Flowering city foul shite all over again. What? Not so. Trot turning round. Whatever. Don your masks and let's go. For now, knock on wood. Good. Eyes in the back of your heads, everyone. Minor. I've already seen several things I'd gladly take with me. Not now. The vault. That's our target. Is that. <laughs> to flee. Lock themselves in. Bollocks! Damn it. Lay down your arms! You have no chance! Perhaps not. <laughs> but we do have hostages. Mercy, Master! On the count of three, we go in! One! Two! <laughs> Come one step closer and folk will die! Hold now! We must negotiate. 
What are your demands? To release the hostages? Buy us a bit of time, Geralt. Not about to hide behind these folk. I'm letting them go. Are you mad? Any idea what'll happen? Yes. And do you have any idea what'll happen if you try to stop me? Out of my way. Now. An honorable deed! The court's sure to consider it a mitigating factor. Now! You've one minute to come out. One at a time. Hands on your heads! The lock. Lovingly crafted. Two spring-loaded bolts, cylindrical plugs, Dameritian wards. I'm not interested. No one's interested. We go in. Geralt, you're at the fore. Why me? It's why I hired you. Now move. With no time. Mm -hmm. Do or die. You don't know who you're fucking with! On the contrary, I know all too well. You... you old... Greetings, brother. Been years. Well, well. Complications, complications. Should have known. Same eyes, same double chin, same rotten heart. I'd have preferred to resolve this elsewise. Stolen the scrolls, thrown you out into the street. Revenge is best served cold, after all. But I don't mind serving it hot. No. I beg you. Mercy. For your brother. I shall do anything you ask. Truly. Anything. Anything. Sign over to me. Oh, if you won't. Then walk out as you stand. Just the clothing. Now, Max Borsodi's house. If you've absolutely got to have it, you'll need to take it from me by force. Hmm. Dumb. But have it your way. Let's make this quick before the soldiers get down here. As I said, at your service.
fight. Need to chat. I'm all ears with you. Got something for you. I love gifts, but I prefer to unwrap them in private. Oi, lads, mind the barrels. Going out for a jabber with Geralt. Cool. Oh, that's better. All right. What do you have for me? Max Persodi's house, as requested. Ah, Horst must be livid. He's not. No? He's not anything except dead. His brother, same thing. A few others too. Stones you've got. But I didn't think you'd have the stomach for a massacre. You wished to hear a whiz. Now you out. Fulfill it. I ride now to visit this Dormus, but one of my men will remain here. He'll know how to find me. That is, of course, should you succeed. At least you can tell me where your wife is. In my old manor, east of Martin Foy's farmstead. I'd wish you Godspeed, but, well, you understand, I'm sure. Goodbye, Geralt. <laughs> <laughs>